Hey guys, how are you doing? Um, today I'm going to be starting to read Finding Stars, the new book that I'm making. So we are going to start on chapter one. I'm sorry if I cannot read this. It's I've been working on this for over a month now. I'm on my second my second book. So I'm going to read this the best that I can. <laughs> Where is it? Wait, said Layla in a pa panic. Where is what? said the blacksmith. My sword, said Layla. Oh, it's on the rack, said the blacksmith. Thanks, said Layla. That was close. I could have been fired for that. As she walked out the door, she spotted someone wearing a cloak in the darkness, but she ignored it and walked away. Spelling corrections, yay. As she walks, she finds a letter with her name on it. Huh. It's kind of creepy that this letter, this letter mysteriously has my name on it, but oh well. Bell rings. Shoot, gotta, gotta make it before it strikes for the last time. Phew, I wasn't late. Layla, you were almost late. If you're late again, you will be executed, said Zane. I'm sorry, I'll try harder, my lord, said Layla, not knowing what to think of it she turns around and steps in line with her guards after about 15 hours of guarding <laughs> she went home but the same person earlier cut her eye again this time there's something glowing coming out from her hands she decided to report this but she remembered she had a letter to read so after she put everything away and did all that stuff i have to do some editing, editing she read the letter it reads, Hello, Leia. You might have noticed me earlier. I know you were looking, going to report me, but please don't. You don't have to look for me, but I will give you clues of who I am and what I'm here for. My name is Mysterious Writing in Abrek. Writing, I guess. I don't know. I'll have to look it up again. And where I come from is a, a place where no one runs. It is if it's not, it was not a gift. Eh. It was, it's if I was non-existing, sorry, uh, words. <sighs> I have a sister named Irene. Before this life, she was your best friend. At the time, you two didn't know what was happening beyond the edge of the, of the dimension. Of course, me being the keeper of dimensions, I had to keep it from going into her dimension. Well, that hadn't turned out so great. As soon as my sister found out, she panicked, but I sent everyone out of that dimension to Earth, including you and one other. And a few others. Sorry. You. Others. <laughs> but during the rebirth, I come to a problem. The monster was actually part of the Irene dimension, so it had to be rebirthed as well. The Lord you're serving is the actual person. Actually, the person, whatever you do, please try not to give him any information about this. Again, don't search for me. I will meet you another time. Don't be surprised if the person in the cloak is doing something specific. Yeah, suspicious. Uh, words, yeah. If you try to talk to that person, she will stop using her magic. Words, yeah, she will stop using her magics and look at you with her eyes. Don't be afraid, although she, she can't see the present, she, <clears throat> she can see the future. <laughs> if you look into her eyes you will see your lord you're working for is really what you're real yeah. <laughs> this is terrible if you do look into her eyes you will see who the lord you're working for really is and what his plan is but he will be fired from your job because he could tell that I am here because he can feel someone looking at his true self. <laughs> I'm sorry. For now, I want to be... She 
Not I. Oh, this is terrible. She wants... Oh, whatever. I want to be hidden so Zane won't attack the city. Please don't do anything stupid. Fabric writing. Okay, after that hiccup, <laughs> I think I'm... Okay, on to the after the letter. I don't know what to think about that, but okay. Since we are going to meet someday, why don't I look into our eyes anyway? I don't care if I lose my job. Anyway, this city won't be destroyed. Well, I better get some rest. Later that night, she had a nightmare about her whole world being torn apart from her past. The next morning, she went outside and looked and looked at went into the alleyway okay she looked went outside and looked at the alleyway an alley she and and she saw a mysterious woman in a cloak she went up to her and just stared as the note said it was true that I looked into her eyes. She would stop using her magics and look at you with her eyes. And I will see who the Lord I'm working for really is and what his plan is. It looked terrifying. Well, I might as well go to work and see if that was true, too. And sure enough, sure enough, she was thrown out of the place and sent back home. But she found another letter name with her name on it. Ah, no! It reads, So you tested me. Well, shame on you. Pack your bags, I'm coming for you tomorrow. Don't worry, you will be teleported for a while to see your past. Don't worry, I created a vac time vacuum so every minute isn't a year on Earth. Get a full night rest of... Full night of rest tonight, you will need it. So, let's see, how long is that chapter? That is a really long chapter. That is a really long chapter, I think. So, I will... I will, um...